Oh, like he's pulling another upset. There's a right cross the lands for Fury. Oh, oh, oh. Don't lie. No way. How is he getting up? How is this man possibly getting up? I just kept counting and he was up by now. It was almost like a fairy tale. Oh my goodness! Somehow Fury has managed to get up! We knew he could box and move. No one knew that this guy had the heart. Can you continue? You want to go? I said, are you okay? He looked at me and he said, yes. I'm a true champion. I bought a brand new Ferrari convertible um, in the summer of 2016 and I was in it and I was on the highway and there's a strip of the highway where I am and at the bottom of about a five mile strip there's a massive bridge that crosses the motorway and I knew that and I got the car up to 190 miles an hour I was heading towards that bridge and I didn't care what no one was thinking. I didn't care about hurting my family, me, my career, people who friends, anybody. I didn't care. I didn't care about nothing. I just wanted to die so bad. I heard a voice say, no, don't do this, Tyson. Think about your kids. Think about your family and your little boys and girls growing up with no father. And everyone saying your dad was a weak man. He left you. He took the easy way out because he couldn't do anything about it. And I, before I turned into the bridge, I, I pulled on the motor and I was shaking. I could feel myself shaking and I pulled over and I was all nervous and I didn't know what to do. I was frightened and I was so afraid. And I got back home, I didn't say anything to the wife, I went straight upstairs into a dark room. And I got on my knees and I was praying and begging God to help me. So I was on my knees in this bedroom and after praying for about 10 minutes, I got up and I felt the weight of the world was lifted off my shoulders. And for the first time in years, I knew I was going to make a comeback.
the light. All praise be to the one and only true God Jesus.